Benefits of Cinnamon Tea Cinnamon tea is a soothing beverage that has a variety of health benefits. While it's generally safe to drink in small amounts, there are some risks to be aware of. In addition to being delicious, cinnamon tea is percolating with perks for your overall health. Here are best benefits of cinnamon tea. Good source of antioxidants Cinnamon tea is loaded with antioxidants. These healthful compounds help neutralize free radicals, molecules that are associated with cancer, heart disease, and diabetes. Specifically, cinnamon is a solid source of polyphenol antioxidants. Studies also show that cinnamon tea can increase your body's total antioxidant capacity. Tack helps your heart. Cinnamon might benefit your heart health. Studies show it may help. Relax blood vessels, reduce blood pressure, raise HDL. Good cholesterol, promote healthy blood circulation, reduce blood triglycerides, and total cholesterol. Good for your skin. Cinnamon can help promote collagen production. This protein acts as a building block for lots of your body parts, including your skin. Collagen can increase elasticity and improve hydration. In turn, it can help keep your skin looking plump and firm. Additionally, Cinnamon's anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties make it a good acne remedy. Might increase hair growth. Can cinnamon transform you into Rapunzel overnight? Number. But it might help your hair grow a bit. A 2018 animal study found that cinnamon oil helped lengthen the hair in male rates. This might be due to cinnamon's cinnamaldehyde levels. This compound is thought to improve blood flow and circulation to hair follicles. Additionally, a 2019 review found that procyonide and a type of flavonoid found in cinnamon A is associated with hair growth, may promote weight loss. Lots of peeps think cinnamon is a natural way to lose weight, but is this true? Well, maybe. Some research shows that cinnamon can aid fat loss in waist circumference. An older study found that participants lost 0.7% of their fat mass and gained 1.1% of muscle mass after taking 10 grams, or 5 teaspoons, of cinnamon powder every day for 3 months. While this stuff sounds promising, more research is needed to show if lower doses of cinnamon A like the amounts found in cinnamon TA can actually make a difference. Reduces inflammation consuming cinnamon might help ease joint swelling. Studies also suggest that this special spice might help reduce inflammation markers. This might mean cinnamon can have a positive effect on inflammatory conditions such as asthma ulcerative colitis Crohn's disease rheumatoid arthritis. It may also help conditions where inflammation is a risk, like Cancer heart disease improve cold symptoms although it won't cure a cold or the flu, cinnamon might make you feel better faster, thanks to its antioxidant properties, cinnamon tea might help give your immune system a boost, in theory, this could speed up your recovery time, sip some cinnamon tea and honey if you feel crummy, even if it doesn't speed up your recovery, it can be very comforting on a sore throat, the soothing steam may also help ease congestion may soothe stomach issues cinnamon contains a phenolic compound called catechine according to a 2017 study catechines might have a positive effect on inflammatory bowel disease ibd symptoms there's also a chance catechine can help ease nausea diarrhea indigestion stomach cramps wards off bacteria cinnamon contains bioactive phytochemicals for example cinnamaldehyde and eugenol this gives it some dope antibacterial properties. A 2018 study found that cinnamon extracts and essential oils were able to damage bacteria's cell membrane, slow motility, and decrease cell division, improve period or PMS symptoms. Lots of menstruating folks claim cinnamon tea can help ease cramps and premenstrual syndrome, PMS, and there's actually some science that backs this up. During a 2018 study, Researchers had 80 participants take 3 grams of cinnamon or a placebo each day for the first 3 days of their period cycle. The people in the cinnamon group had significantly less pain than those who took the placebo. Risks of drinking cinnamon tea liver damage, cassia, aka regular, cinnamon contains coumarin. When consumed in excess, this compound has been known to cause liver damage, oral lesions, 
folks with a cinnamon sensitivity might experience sore ulcers or lesions. This is prob because cinnamon contains cinnamaldehyde, a compound that can trigger allergic reactions. Low blood sugar, eating cinnamon can help lower your blood sugar, but consuming too much might lead to low blood sugar. Medication interactions, you should def talk with a healthcare professional before adding cinnamon tea to your diet. Cinnamon has been known to interact with certain medications, especially ones that are used to treat liver conditions or diabetes. How much, and how often, to drink lots of commercial teas are made with cassia cinnamon which is a rich source of coumarin. On average, a teaspoon of ground cinnamon contains 7 to 18 grams of the stuff. According to an older study, the healthy intake of coumarin is about 5 milligrams a day for a 130-pound person. That means even a single teaspoon of cassia cinnamon could take you over the daily limit. How to prepare cinnamon tea You can easily make cinnamon tea with a few simple ingredients. Here's how. Fill a pot with 2 cups of water, add 2 cinnamon sticks, bring to a boil, remove cinnamon sticks, pour tea into a large cup, voila, pro tip, add a tablespoon of honey, a squeeze of lemon, or a splash of your favorite milk for a delicious flavor.